Now, the African Union is working on implementing the AU reform plan. It's expected to enable the union to better meet its goals and better serve African citizens based on its founding principles. But it will be up to member states of the, con of the continental body to make or break this promising plan. Ministers and African business leaders are, however, optimistic that the plan will succeed. Here's CGTN's Gurum Chala with more. The African Union reform is banked on to transform the way business is handled at the Commission and overall change the continent through better cooperation among member states and its citizens. Foreign Ministers CGTN spoke to say the time is now to practice what was discussed. The reform of the African Union and the change that we want to see on the continent, it's about doing it. Uh, we've already talked about doing it. We have uh, a decision of heads of state. We, um, on the Rwandan side, which uh, you know the, the president of Rwanda is in charge of overseeing implementation now, we, we think certain decisions can be implemented right away. President Kagame has taken everybody along, you know, so all the presidents, you know, have contributed, uh, the executive council, the ministers of state, uh, the foreign ministers rather, and um, the permanent representatives uh, in Addis, you know, so, so you have this buy-in of all the critical actors. And so um, we're very optimistic that uh, this time round uh, we will have the, um, the implementation that's required. The African Union reform has plans to make the AU more efficient politically, operationally and financially so that the continental organization is better positioned to meet its mandate. This literally is the biggest and boldest move of the union since the adoption of Agenda 2063. So what is next? We are now uh, May at the summit in June we want to be able to show progress, some level of progress. For example, and beginning with the way the summit of July will be organized, streamlined, uh, focused on only very, very few strategic um, items on the agenda of heads of state. Rwandan President Paul Kagame and its Z's reform advisory team members who are behind the formulation of the implementation roadmap Africa's renowned business tycoon Strive Masiima says this reform is vital even for effective trading within Africa. Economic development is at the center of the reform. Okay? Uh, the African Union has led Africa uh, through its decolonization through uh, consolidating the political gains. Now it must lead us through economic development. So it's a major asset as, a, as, a, as an agency to help Africa function economically. If all goes well, the African Union reform plan, once put into practice, will grant the AU full financial independence and assist Africa finance its projects and peacekeeping works. Grumtala CGTN at Isababa, Ethiopia.